Ooh, awesome day. Come on along, stick around, hang out. Let's do some grocery shopping. Let's do some cooking. Um, you know, let's see what kind of food I'm eating today to get from like this to look like this. You're gonna love it. Stick around. Good morning. <clears throat> Crazy hair today. Hopefully you're having a great day. Um, here has been a been a really kind of a crazy week um, a lot of sadness in the family this week so if you're interested in seeing any of uh, that kind of stuff go over and check out my Instagram because I do post a lot of uh, stuff that's happening in personal life plus a lot of uh, like the meals and stuff that we have or when we go out to restaurants and stuff like that a lot of the uh, stuff that happens in my personal life so if you're interested in kind of you know, because I don't share a lot of that stuff on YouTube. and um, But if you're interested, go over there and check out my uh, Instagram. Kind of check out that stuff. Um, you know, i um, really, really, really appreciate it if you, if you go over there and check it out and start following me. So, uh, the link is down below. So, start my day off. Day of eating. Start off with my coffee. Um, I put some collagen in it, my coffee, uh, some MSM Pure in it, uh, some monk fruit drops, and uh, some coconut cream. That's all that goes in my coffee. And generally, that's all I have for breakfast. It's, yeah, it's a couple hundred calories and, I don't know, zero carbs, but still, you know, it, it's pretty filling and it's, it's good enough for me for breakfast. So, so that's all I'm having for breakfast. I'm not really sure what's going on during the day, um, so hang around and check it out. I'm not even sure what I'm going to have for lunch. I haven't even looked at in the, the refrigerator. We do need to go get some groceries. I don't know whether we'll do it today or wait until tomorrow <clears throat> so that we have a chance to look at some sale flyers and stuff of that nature. Um, but hang around. Let's uh, see what happens today and uh, see how the day goes. All right. I'll come back and we'll see what we're going to do and dig through the freezer and the refrigerator and see what we're going to do for lunch all right so <clears throat> for lunch it's going to be really really simple so i got two burgers here they're about five ounces a piece um, i'm not sure i'll eat both of them but i'm gonna i'm gonna try so so eat those two burgers i'm actually going to put them on a, uh i have a couple of southwest wraps in here so i'm going to bring these southwest wraps um, I'm going to try to put them on one Southwest wrap, but I may have to, because the burgers are pretty good size, um, I may have to put one on two different burgers. So um, so that's what I'm going to have for lunch. No cheese or anything with them. Uh, and then, of course, my supplements right here, which are the... Uh, um, if you don't want to, if you're interested in what the supplements are, let me know. Um, if you'd like to see me go through them again, there's a B12 tablet, there's... Um, a fish oil tablet uh, let's see there's a um, the keto chow electrolyte tablets which are pretty cool I'm enjoying those uh, trying to think what else to serve there's a zinc tablet there's a K2 uh, D3 tablet and there's an iodine tablet so if you're interested in seeing those let me know down in the comments if you're interested in seeing those um, Nothing really, really exciting for lunch, um, but that's what I'm gonna have. Kind of been on the road a little bit for the last week, so things are really kind of a little messed up. So uh, I gotta try to uh, to be a little stricter this coming week, so that I can get my body back to uh, where it should be. It wasn't the way <laughs> I intended to do things the last week, but uh, it, it, life happens, right? So. Um, you know, but that's really, really simple lunch. Um, 10 ounces of ground beef and, uh, you know, and uh, the egg life wraps. So um, I am thinking I'm gonna do a video. If you'd like to see a video of me making some egg life wraps, let me know down below. Um, kind of like to play around with some flavoring and stuff as well, some seasoning, um, just to kind of season them a little bit and try some different things so if that's something you're interested in let me know down in the comments and maybe we'll do a video on especially if you don't have egg life wraps in your area they don't sell them 
or they're, you think they're too expensive and you'd like to make them on your own, um, you can kind of play around with that, uh, that thought process and tell me down in the comments if you'd like to see that video. Um, I do have a video where we did a bunch of experiments with them, so I'd like to continue on down that path a little bit too. Um, let me know. All right, I'll see you in the next segment when it's lunchtime. All right, here's my two burgers, my egg life wraps. There's actually three egg life wraps in there. I counted them out. I opened it up. So I'm going to probably use all three of them. Um, all right, I'm going to heat these up, and we'll come back, and I'll show you what the sandwich looks like. All right, so that's what it's going to look like. I'm going to put this on the top, and I'm going to cut that up. And I have one extra one that I guess I'm not going to use, so I'm only going to use two. Um, I'll come back in a minute. Let's see what it's going to taste like. So checking out the strawberries, look at some nice red ones in there. A lot of berries still to be picked. Really good. There's some really big ones there. I often wonder how they get them to come out like that so they can easy pick, easily pick them. <coughs> so good. Over there they're getting the other field ready there. I start planting over there <clears throat> probably in the next couple of days beautiful day out kind of a cloudy day we had some rain last night not so much of a southern california these days it's been really cool i think even today's supposed to be high at like 59 or 60 degrees which is really uh cool for us so but out for my walk getting into some exercise trying to get my steps in um, you know, trying to do all that good stuff, but uh, yeah, you can see up above some clouds, some some sunshine, so in and out. So when the sun's out, it's not too bad. When the sun goes in, it's pretty chilly, and you have to zip the coat up and um, get all, all you know warm back up. And it's just crazy weather. It's I don't understand it. We're you know we we normally are in the 70s, 70s this time of year, and. Um, you know, it's usually Southern California, it's usually pretty warm, and boy, we're having really cool weather. This is, everybody's saying it's the longest winter that they've ever remembered. Even some of the folks that have grown up here and were born and raised here, so. Um, but anyway, I'm still getting on my walk out. Can't let the weather get stop me, so hopefully you get out and get motivated and get moving. See you in the next segment. Hey, so real quick, like, um... This is a funky angle of the camera, but I thought it'd be cool to kind of see what's on the counter and stuff. And hopefully you still see me in it. Um, so stop at the store real quick, like get a couple of things. I got some baby spinach for some salads that I plan on having over the next couple of weeks or the next week or so. Um, great for lunches, easy to make. Um, throw on a protein on the top, some, some tuna or some chicken or something on top. Um, picked up some of the coconut milk as well. Um, and then we picked up a couple things that were on sale. The uh, the blackberries were on sale, buy one, get one free. So that was cool. And then the uh, blueberries were uh, on sale, regular $5.99. They were on sale for um, $3.79. So that was a pretty good deal. They had eggs on sale that for $3.99. So the prices in the eggs are getting back down there. So um, so that was, uh, that was good, happy with that. Uh, my wife wanted some tomatoes for some recipes that she cooks and she's cooking up. Um, and then I came across these uh, chicken legs. These chicken legs were had a reduced sticker on them. There's two packages of them. They actually had a bunch of them, so I don't know how long they'll last, but um, so they were reduced price. Um, the reduced price is 83 cents a pound. So to me, that was a big, really, really good deal. So um, so we got two of them. These are the family packs. Um, there's about four pounds a piece. 
uh, four pounds of chicken legs in one of these, so that's good. Um, that will last us a while. So there's just a quick little thing. Um, nice budget, always looking for a sale. So we're going to throw these in the freezer and uh, actually going to cook one up tomorrow and then uh, throw one in the freezer though. So I um, just thought I'd show you it real quick like um, we'll come back in the next segment and I'll show you what we're going to do for dinner. Hey, we're going to make some blackened cod for dinner tonight. So we're going to oil the fish up, give them a nice massage. And then we're going to coat them with some some seasoning, homemade seasoning. So. All right. Then the seasoning goes on. Look at that master chef, I'm telling you. You must have chef like that. <laughs> Doesn't that look good? Man. All right, it's ready to go into the air fryer. Look at that, look how thick those are. Those cod are nice, nice. Into the air fryer it goes. Ooh, look at that yummy, yummy fish. Who wants some fish? All right, here's tonight's dinner. A couple of nice pieces of cod, blackened <clears throat> with some broccoli. A couple more pieces over there for my wife. She's actually got some other fish too as well. But that's my dinner for tonight, so. Looks good. Hey, so we're wrapping up the end of the day. So, um, what do you think? Um, I think it was a good day. Um, again, when we talked about lean days before, this is kind of what I would call one of those lean days um, <clears throat> where I'm kind of eating leaner meals, right? So, you know, the uh, cod is really high in protein, it's really low in fat. <clears throat> So, um, and then the ground beef, again, was moderate. So, you know, I'm not going to restrict my fat too much. I still need that fat, right? So, <clears throat> again, so, but I, I, this is what I mean by one of those leaner days. Um, I even had enough uh, in there left over to have a little tiny piece of uh, Lily's chocolate. So I did do that as well. That's in my macros. Um, so just a refresher. So I had my coffee and I had my coconut cream in it and I had the MSM coarse flakes in it. I had the uh, monk fruit extract in it, and I had the collagen peptide in it. For lunch, I had those that burger, 80-20. Uh, it was about 9.5 ounces, 10 ounces when I weighed it this morning. And I had two Southwest wraps, so a really, really super low-carb day for lunch. And then I had the, the cod fillets um, and the broccoli, and I ate a little piece of uh, the uh, hazelnut milk chocolate lilies. Um, and that was my day. So, um, it's a pretty good day. I think it was a pretty good day. These are kind of the lean days um, that I'm talking about. We're going to go up here and I'm going to show you the macros up here. So, here are the macros up here. So, um, my protein was 163 out of 164. So, it was really, really, really where I wanted it was. I didn't plan it that way. It just happened that way. My fat was at 69 when I wanted it at 92. So, that's good. I was trying to keep it lower fat and trying to do a lower fat day. Total calories, uh, my calories was 1,462. Um, my carbs were 14. Now remember, a good portion of those were actually, seven of those were actually that Lily's chocolate chip. So I actually really did under um, 10 carbs today. 
Um, <clears throat> so if I didn't eat that chocolate, um, I would have been at seven total carbs for the day. So um, that's where I was. My fiber was eight. My net carbs were five for the day. So that's what I'm talking about when I talk about lean days. Uh, I got in my walk. Um, right now I'm at 11, a little over 11,000 steps. So I'm not quite to my 12,000 steps, but pretty close for the day. So, um, so I'm going to take this as a win, right? So uh, everything worked out well. Um, so um, <clears throat> we had kind of gone away for a weekend. And uh, so just kind of needed to, to kind of get back into it and get going again. So, so that was my day of eating. Uh, hopefully you liked it. Hopefully you give the thumbs up. Hopefully you hit that subscribe button, hit that bell icon, you know. Hey, I'd be greatly appreciative if you do that for me. Um, love to do it. We really want to show some some support. Share your video out to your friends, family, um, on your channel if you have a channel or uh, other sources, right? So um, the other people you think could see what you eat when you're doing keto and you're eating um, a high protein or lower and lower fat, right? So... Um, version of uh, keto so hey you guys are awesome you guys are great you know again you know support the channel that would be wonderful you know there's a couple different ways of doing it so it's up to you um, also don't forget to check out this next video over here that's coming out that youtube's going to suggest to you or click on this alan's awesome logo over here if you want to continue to watch other great content like this and i'm going to see you guys in the next video